So last night uh, I tested the mount with my telescope. Okay, so in this kit we have cables, one step controller, bracket to attach it to the Gemini G53F mount. We will attach it on the side of the mount into this larger hole so it's nicely tucked under the main drives. Um, first, we have to remove the standoffs that come with the on-step controller and attach our 3D printed adapter to the controller. Okay, we have attached the 3D printed bracket onto the controller. Now we simply insert it into the large hole on the side and secure it with M6 bolt inserted into the adapter from this side. Okay, so the motors are connected. We have also connected the power to the controller and USB cables to the laptop. So we can now perform a quick go to test. First, we have to connect. So now uh, let's do a quick go to that's it. Next test is under the stars and with the telescope mounted so we can see how it performs while doing astrophotography okay so first test under the stars everything is set up i did polar alignment and after that everything basically worked out of the box uh, the go-to with uh, plate solving performed without a hitch it centered the objects flawlessly um, now we are capturing uh, two minute exposures with uh, luminance filter since the uh, moon is not uh, in the sky at the moment uh, we'll see how it goes but so far stars look great let's just have a quick look at the single frame okay, this is a single two minute exposure stars look nice and round so looks like everything is set up properly So last night uh, I tested the mount with my telescope, 10 inch Newton. Um, the first thing I wanted to check was uh, the tracking precision. Um, and as you already saw in this video before, during the session everything looked okay and it worked properly towards the morning mount, even automatically parked at the set time in sequence generator pro. So all is well mount is precise as is expected from friction mount um, tonight we will check additional features which every mount has to have such as automatic meridian flip uh, setting park position uh, limits so the mount stops at the limit and if everything works well um, it will be ready for the customer we will also offer this upgrade of the Gemini G53F mount on our shop because the stock controller is a bit problematic so uh, that's why this customer contacted me and we performed an upgrade with the on-step controller which works uh, very well by the way um, and that's about it fingers crossed for tonight Ready? 
medium flip, fingers crossed. First split solve, after that, slowing to the other side. Let's see if it works. And voila! Automatic Meridian Flip in Sequence Generator Pro on Gemini G53F with upgraded controller to on step. Meridian Flip finished and the sequences keep on running. So the tests were successful. I think this is about uh, ready to go to the customer. There's a beautiful night. I wish you all clear skies and lots of captured photos.